Now you buy a pack of 10 from me for 15 quid, you can't get cheaper tile bits which will do this anywhere on the planet of the earth. Do you know what I mean? You might think you can, but you can't, trust me. I'm like a doctor, I've been using them for 25 years and these are the best what I've found. So the first thing you do, you need to get a drill. You need to get a decent drill. Get a decent drill. Tighten it up. Make sure when you put it in there, in the chamber, that you tighten straight. You don't want it tightened like twisted, because when you start drilling, it's not going to drill straight. I like to have it just a little bit past it, tighten it up, and then click it back. So on your drill, just click it back, it locks it in. Firstly, these are ceramic tiles. We're going to go through all the tiles. So these are ceramic tiles, there's two different types, there's a pattern one, there's a non-pattern non one, yeah? Now this drill, with this tile bit, with that one, you must probably drill about 50 holes in there, do you know what I mean? I'm not going to bore you with drilling these because it's, it, it's just like butter. So, in fact, I'll tell you what i do, I'll tell you what i do for this demonstration, We'll go through all six, yeah? So you put all six down. Firstly, when you go to drill this, pretending you're on a wall, pretend this is on a wall, yeah? So we just look that way. So you get your corner, your tip. Go bother with masking tape. I've seen a lot of videos saying masking tape and this, that, and other. You don't need it. You don't need it. You're learning off a professional now. Do you know what I mean? The only thing you need to learn is what I do. Do you know what I mean? Because I'm one of the best. Don't forget it. So, you get your drill on an angle and then that drives your point can you see your point going into the tile that's it so just drilled 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 Broke the bottom one because the tile's flapping on the bench, it's loose. So, he did actually drill it, but he did also snap it. Which that what will happen if your tiles are loose. So, as you can see, that one bit's just gone through. Like butter, the bit, it gets very hot, so don't touch it because you burn yourself. So this is where, because we've drilled that, and we're going on to porcelain, we're going to put a new bit in. And we'll see how many how many times this drills through porcelain. Porcelain, the hardest material you'll ever drill through. It's harder than everything else. You can use one of these as well if you want. On ceramic. Porcelain it's not gonna do it. You need a bigger drill. So with porcelain, get a sponge, you wet it, that's to keep the drill bit cool. Now, what we'll do, we'll start, this is polished porcelain. Polished porcelain, this is the hardest stuff you'll ever drill. Known to man, do you know what I mean? You can wet it, with this being polished porcelain, what happens is, you say you've got a marker and you march your spot there and you want to drill it exact in that spot. What you have to do, get your drill bit, get your finger, guide it. Guide it like a dream. And then wiggle it, and with this, you have to cool the bit down, otherwise you're just going to snap the end off. With this, there's two options. You can drill it really slow, so when that's turning, it don't warm up too much, and then the end won't snap off. If it warms up too much, you're going to snap off. And then, obviously, you've got another drill bit, but that's why, with a pack of 10 for 15 quid, one, one pack of these, I normally go through about five packs, because I don't use water. Um, on a bathroom on a second fix because it's so fast and boom straight bish bash bosh straight in with air I'm not bothered if I snap five bits five bits that's seven pound fifty that's nothing do you know what I mean you go into a shop retailers you will be paying seven pound fifty for one do you know what I mean so it begs to differ so what you can do is once you've started it if you want it to last if you're bothered you want it to last keep it wet 
it's like dipping the pencil, do you know what I mean? In a wick, keep it wet, lubricated, and it'll always slide, won't it? Same thing. There you go. You've seen it with your very own eyes. Straight through the porcelain. Amp marked it. Amp marked it. Beautiful. Just can't beat it. You just can't beat it. So what I'm going to do now is with this one bit, we're going to see how many we get. We'll we will try. We'll try to coach it. We'll try coach it and see how many we're going to do out this. But did you see how fast that was? You know what I mean? It's like a whip it. That's free. And four, what's that, less than a minute? Less than a minute. Just drill bit, just go over the pound. That's five. That's seven. Beautiful, that's eight. So let's have a look. Eight in porcelain, less than two minutes. Be splash bosh. Even did a smiley face for you. Now you can't get better than that, no matter what. No matter what, there's not another demo out there on the planet of the earth that can show me better. Do you know what I mean? There's just not. So that is polished porcelain. Now we're gonna go to the ragged porcelain. This is a, a textured porcelain demonstrating on every single type of material that you want solid it's a bit more trickier to use what you do is you save that and you can drill your ceramic tiles with them drill your ceramic tiles with these now all day long so I'll just show you There you go, all day long, do the best about, do the best on the market, do you know what I mean, that's another one. So, I won't use them again for another porcelain because it's just not going to work. So we'll get another bit. Now this is where you could snap the ends off because this is the textured surface of porcelain, the hardest porcelain known to man, do you know what I mean. Hardest porcelain known to man. Start again. Keep wobbling it with this, you wobble it more because we need to try to get the, the texture off it. We're not cutting anything else, we're just wobbling as drilling, it's taking the surface off it. Uh, 
and you have to keep this wet otherwise you will go through them that's one That's two. Snap me tile. That would have been free. That, that, it won't snap a tile on the wall. Snapping a tile because it's loose on this surface. Four. This takes a lot more drilling because of the texture on the surface. Now, if I wanted to keep that for ceramic, what I'd do is I'd swap a bit now because we've done four bits with it. And, uh, with this surface being so rough, it bluntens the tip on these like no tomorrow, but you've done four holes, which is quite good for the pound a bit. But for this demonstration, we'll see how many it'll drill. Getting harder now, you can feel it. Feel it in the arm. And that's it. The bit snap that's because of letting it to hot and that's what will happen this will happen if you let it to hot but we've drilled one two three four five six snapped on its seventh and if i would have slowed down a bit kept it wet it wouldn't have snapped but you find me a bit drill clear seven holes through porcelain as clear as that as fast as that, with no effort, come back to me, because you can't, because it's impossible. It is impossible. Now the next thing. Big dirty piece of granite. Woo, that's heavy. Now I predict that this is gonna fly through this. New bit. See how that's twisted there? This is a classic example. Can you see how it's in the drill twisted? When I'm drilling there, see how it's wobbling? Classic example. That tip's not gonna last. If I try to drill with that tip now because, it, because I put it in the drill wrong, it's not gonna work. Take it back out, get it, get it bang on, tighten it up, click it back, give it a little wet. This has got like uh, metal fibers in it, as you can see. So let's see. This is 30 mil thick, this 30 mil. That's getting up. That is getting up. 30 mil, boom. 
straight through. Now you can't get that in market, can you? Do you know what I mean? No, but you can get it from MJC Kitchens and Bathrooms. The link is on front of my page. £15 a pack. So you can go buy your pipe bits for £20 and £30. I bet I could beat you with one of these. And these, when you break it down, when you take the postage off, is about a pound twenty each. Fish bash bosh, try go on. That's two. 30 mil gallons. That's what that is is some metal in the in the uh, in the um, granite. Get one in it. You know what I mean? That's why you always wear glasses because if I wouldn't have been wearing glasses, bits could have flown up and it would have hit me in the eye. If I take my glasses off, you can see the specs there. And it's just backfired in a bit. Yeah, this isn't doing bad, this. This is not doing bad. Let's speed it up a bit. 